Hi, a very good morning. <laughs> My name is Karol Izwan. I'm from Group 40 from CP3 T104. And today we're going to discuss about conversion of number system. And today we have our special guest, Chaffee Pai. <laughs> okay. okay. Thank you, Kai. Okay. okay, my name is Shafi, and today we will discuss the first uh, conversion, binary to decimal. So, first we need to understand the number, 1001, in base 2. Then, we make a table, arrange the numbers, then add the power. Then, we multiply them, and we get uh, 1, multiply by... 2 to the power of 0 is 1 and uh, 2 is 0 is plus 0 and plus 1 to the power of 3 is 8 then we add, add, add uh, sum them and we have the 8 base 10 Hi, ok we already know how to convert binary to decimal now I'm going to show you how to convert decimal to binary Okay, let's say we have our decimal number which is 9, so we're going to convert it to binary. And to do this, we just need to divide it by 2. So, 9 divided by 2 is 4.5, right? Therefore, the 0 0.5 will be 1. Uh, the process will be carried on, which is 4 divided by 2. There is no remainder, so it will be 0. <laughs> 2 divided by 2, it will be 0 also. And 1 divided by 2, we we'll get 0 0.5, which is also 1. And we just rearrange it from the bottom to the top, we we'll get 1001 base 2. Okay? Hi, saya Almi. Hari ini kita akan tentang kata cara untuk convert hexa decimal to decimal. Di bagi soalan 10A, so first thing kita perlu buat adalah favor. Susun, susun satu box ni satu nombor atau kita sebut contohnya 1 kosong dengan A A sama dengan 10 so kita akan pergi jangan lupa simbol darab ni memandangkan kita perlu darabkan ni dengan ni tekan kekeleta masing-masing 10 darab dengan 16 kuasa kosong sama dengan 10 kosong darab dengan 16 kuasa 1 sama dengan kosong 1 darab dengan 16 kuasa 2 sama dengan 256 Total up semua, kita akan dapat 266 base 10 Hi, with me again, Khairul We will go to decimal to hexadecimal Okay, uh, we, let's say we had our decimal 266 Okay, how do we convert it to hexadecimal? Okay, this is one of the ways At first, we divide 266 divided by 16 we would get 16.625 okay if we get 16.625 will be 0 0.625 times 16 we would get 10 okay. 10 in hexa is yes 8 now we would get 16 16 divided by 16 is 1 there is no remainder therefore it would be 0 now we uh, now one divided by sixteen, it will get zero point zero six two five, and zero point zero six two five times sixteen will get one. Now, as from the decimal to binary, we go from below to top, we we'll get one zero eight. That's all. Hi. Now we go to the binary to hexadecimal. So we give uh, we 
get here on one one zero one. Just same like the hexa to binary. We we will click it in the backward. One two four eight. If you see zero below the numbers, you cut it. So one plus four plus eight is thirteen. The answer is one. So next we convert thirteen to D. So the answer is one D by sixty. Okay, that is all from us from Group Forty CP3 T Twenty Four. Don't forget to like, share to your friends, and. Subscribe to PST CSKML and see you later. Bye. Bye.